Today, Molly and I are going to a steering group meeting for the National Council for Palliative Care. It's only Molly's second charity event she's ever been to since qualification and we're really looking forward to it. The steering group guides the, the National Council for Palliative Care through all their campaigns and work, so I'm really looking forward to contributing to that. And I, so I've heard, all the people that are attending are very excited to meet Molly, which is lovely, so she's probably going to rise to the occasion and get a lot of fuss. You know, it's lovely that I can take Molly with me and she can come everywhere and we can do things together. It gives me so much confidence and just so much calmness, I suppose, that she's there. I relax more, I get, I get more confident and I just feel better for having her with me. And the fact that she can help me as well is absolutely wonderful. I'm sure Molly's absolutely going to love it today. I'm sure she will. She loves all the kind of attention and all the charity work and everything like that. So I'm really excited for her to be with me today. And we will update you as the day goes on. Just about to put Molly's jacket on, ready to go. We're now in London, we've arrived about half an hour ago, we're about to go into the event in about half an hour, we've just taken Molly to the toilet and she's been a really really good girl so far and I'm really looking forward to seeing how she gets on in the, in the meeting itself. I have a lot of faith in her, she's done so well already and I'm just really excited to show her off to everybody.
just been to an event for the National Council of Palliative Care and Molly was an absolute superstar. She laid quietly under the table the whole time, didn't fuss, didn't bother anyone unless they asked her, asked me to, if they could fuss her. She did really, really well and the meeting was really interesting. I'm really excited about all the prospects I have working with the National Council of Palliative Care and Molly is our little unofficial mascot now. We're just on our way home from the National Council of Palliative Care's steering group meeting. We're exhausted but absolutely exhilarated. It was a fantastic event and Molly was a star. She laid quietly under the table the whole meeting, said hello to a couple of people when they said hello to her, but apart from that, stayed under the table and was a really good girl. I felt it was a really productive meeting. I really enjoyed, I enjoyed it and I found that you know, there's going to be a lot of opportunities outside of the steering group for me through the National Council of Palliative Care, which I really enjoyed. So that's going to be really, really good and it's a good start for Molly, her, only her second outing to a charity event and she proved she's just ready, she's proved she's ready, she's done it absolutely perfectly and I cannot fault her. Today we went to a meeting for the National Council of Palliative Care, their steering group, and had a fantastic day. I learnt a lot about the charity and its work, and Molly had a really good experience as my assistant's dog. She laid quietly under the table, didn't bother anybody, unless I gave her the command to say hello. She slept through most of it, only fussed a little bit at one point, but apart from that she was foot perfect. And the event for me was a really, really good one. I learnt, as I said, I learnt a lot, I had a really good time, and it was very, very interesting. So. You know, it was a real success of a day because Molly was so good and the meeting went really well and I got there after the disaster and nearly missing it due to problems with, with the venue. And so it was lovely to actually be there to succeed, to contribute and for Molly to have been foot perfect like she was. I'm just amazed with her and I'm so proud of how the day went. Molly is a little superstar. She's been foot perfect today. I cannot fault her and I'm so proud of her. And I just hope this will continue, as I'm sure it will in the future with all my other charity events, that she'll be just as good and calm and quiet as she has been today.